It seemed like I'd never get out. Killer hit a pick me up. I'm glad someone kept in touch. See, Killer was Seven's best friend. Been cool since they was little. Story is they met in kindergarten. First day of school, they got in a fight. And been cool ever since. Killer lawyer as hell, but a live wire. And well, the name speaks for itself. Shit. I'm miss y'all here, baby. You're probably wondering by now who am I and who is Seven. Well, let me take you back. Hey, hey, I'm living all the way I'm living all the way Yeah, I'm I keep a game full of haters cause I'm steady and crease yeah, money. More money, more hoes, so I guess I'm all the way deep Yeah, I'm hot, fresh about the flying pan, still grease Hot assassin off on the track, left the baseline bleed Straight out the studio, a groupie, whole claiming she need Say she was your whole stupid, but her brains was decent I feel it jeaned it like Mike, popped on the ass and beat it Probably why they be hating cause they say me, Excuse me, excuse me, ladies Damn, baby girl, I don't see no arm band on you, baby Okay. What the fuck you gonna drink? I mean, but who is you, boo? She ain't come to this motherfucker. I'm the owner. Oh. Mm -hmm. It's my birthday, and um, me and my girl. Come this way, man. Chill a little. I ain't gonna see you, man. Come on. At that moment, he became everything to me. At that moment, he became everything to me. His strength, his control, his style. All of it was something I wanted, something I longed for. He was a drug dealer. He didn't hide it, but I stayed. I now know it was probably because I never had a father, but I was too blind to see it then. We went out a couple of times, just regular dates. I became more intrigued and was beginning to admire him. For some reason, I looked up. So what's your favorite color? Actually, I got three. What are they? Red, black, and green. The flag colors. Yeah, you know what they mean? Huh? Red is for the blood. Okay. Black is for the people. All right. And green is for the land. <laughs> See? Didn't think I knew, huh? Nah, I kind of figured you was a smart one. I try. All right. So what's your people like? My mama died when I was born. Daddy, he was straight. Revolutionary nigga. Got out locked up when I was like 10. They say he killed somebody, but I think the people set him up. That's how they do. Yeah. So I moved in with my uncle. He was always on some other shit. When I moved out there, that's when I started with some Miller. Had him put me on, you know, the rest of history. See, Miller was like a big brother or father to the streets back in the day. Seven started working for him at 11 years old. He taught him everything he knew about the game and about being a man. Seven always wanted to be just like him. By the time I met Seven, him and Miller had took over the streets together. Why you do what you do? Product of my environment, baby. That's all I know. So, besides this, do you have goals? Yeah. I want all my record label. I ain't with that new hip hop shit. My shit gotta have a message. I got old shit. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I like that idea. So, is Seven your real name? Yeah. Daddy gave me that name. You know what I mean? I don't know what to tell I don't have to ask. I know a God when I see one. All right, so you know you mad. That's what's up. Me and you, baby. Up, nigga. I fell asleep, nigga. Ah, shit. Mm.
We gonna have to look good too, man. What time is it? I don't even know, man. Oh, she told me you had somebody over here last night. Shh, I did. She must have left. I know what she left. Yeah, let me get there. Yeah. I had a good time. I'll be back. Ronnie. I bounced on your ass, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah. At least you fuck, nigga. You ain't had to throw out. She did you a favor, nigga. Come on, man. Chill out, man. We ain't fuck with your talk. What else, nigga? For real. That might be the new first lady right there, nigga. For real? Yeah. Shit, that's what's up, nigga. Shit. <laughs> real nigga, don't get dressed, though, man. Real. Now everybody to fuck with normal and shit, nigga. Shit, let them niggas wait, man. Rush the nigga shit, man. Take look. Been a minute, boy. Where you been? Bro. Between keeping these niggas in these holes in line, bro. I can't even think straight. Shit, nigga, you the boss. You should never stress about that. That's what you got workers for. As far as these women, as long as they take care of, they shouldn't have shit to say. Nigga, I feel you. Fuck you manage all these hoes you got. Key word, hoes. I only have one wife. As long as these other hoes play their position, everything good on my end, bro. And plus, I keep my hoes in pocket. <laughs> Shake me, boy. Hell no. Man, what? Oh, hell no. Who is it? It's me. Me who? Ronnie. I need you. What you say? I was knocked out, huh? Yeah, seemed like you was tired. Hey, um, I ain't know what you want to eat, but uh, there's some food in the refrigerator if you want some. I'll get something later. You sure? Yeah. All right. Reading the paper, huh? I wouldn't have thought you read the paper. Only the business section. Got investments. Everything looking copacetic. Motherfucker losing all my money, though. Yeah, I'm tired. Shit. What's that? What? That. Why you wear the ring if you separated? Because I lied. You lied, huh? I ain't separated. I mean, why would you tell me you separated and you not? I can't be with no married man. Shit, you already is. What's up? Where you going? Hey. Hey, 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 turn around. Come here. Let me talk to you. Come here. What's up? You just not right. I mean, you said you were separating. I mean, you ain't give me a choice. I can't do this. You can and you will. You need me. I need you. You feel me? You gotta understand, my organization built like chess. I'm missing a piece. I need you to be my queen, you feel me? So you want me to be your queen? Yeah, first lady. So, I mean, shouldn't your wife play that position? Nah, nah, you different. I keep all this shit away from my other family, you feel me? My wife ain't strong enough for all this. You, you gutter, strong, loyal, you feel me? Perfect. So what? I mean, am I supposed to just be your mistress forever? Nah, man, you looking at it the wrong way. First lady forever, you feel me? Soon you gonna find somebody else, you gonna move on, but you still gonna be my first lady, you feel me? Hey. I love you. Don't ever think I don't, you feel me? I should have left, but I stayed. I was in love, and he controlled my mind. 
But besides being a young, cute thing on the side, I was his best friend, and he was mine. I accepted my position and became accustomed to it. He took me out other days of the week, but Saturdays he spent with his family. He got me out my grandma house and got me my own place. Took me when he got his work and even showed me the ins and outs of the business. That was my position and I played it well. That little boy just looks so familiar. Really? Maybe you know it long. I'll be right back. Okay. I never thought I'd see her face to face, and I always wondered, if I did, how would I feel? I know you, and I know you know me. No, I don't think. <laughs> don't lie. Did he at least tell you my name? It's Jasmine. Lonnie. So how does it feel? How does what feel? Meeting the wife, the one person you know you will never be. <laughs> you know, I bet you two thought you had me fooled. The wife always knows her part of the job description. But that happens to be the same part of my life I have to sacrifice so that me and my son can live lavish and we can have the best. Shit. Not you, some other girl, but you remember this. See, we might be in competition right now, but sooner or later, someone has to be the winner. I'm through. I'm starting to get a fucking headache. Hey, babe, where you at? Hey, you was that early when I called you? You don't hear me talking to you? Queen! What's wrong with you, man? Where you been? Hey, look, Dennis. Whatever. Whatever. What the fuck wrong with you, man? I saw her. Who? Jasmine. Man, that's what you acting like that about, man. Why you think I gave you the bitch up? So you'll know if you see her. She'd have been two years. She was bound to happen. She knew me. Yeah, man, she spoke to me. I felt like shit. For what? Y'all ain't no different. Shit. If anything, she should've felt crazy, man. She ain't even say nothing about shit. Really? Why should she feel crazy? I mean, I'm the mistress. My best friend, man. But tighten up, man. Come on, man. What's up? Get off me. Man, what the fuck wrong with you, man? You don't lost your rabbit ass now, man. Nah, man, just move, move, just move for a second. What you tripping about, man? Cause, man, I was man, bad. Hey, 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 tighten up, man. I, I explained all this shit in the beginning, man. You feel me? I you wanna come with all this shit here, man. We getting all this money, man. Let's keep it out of here. shit. Man, that was embarrassing. You, you want me to lie to you? Lisa was there. I ain't even know what to say. Man, fuck that, man. You looking at the unimportant shit, man. For real. Tighten up, man. Let's chill out, man. Watch your move or something. Come on, I got some new shit. Check this out. Come on, 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 come on. Damn. Damn, you gonna keep going on with that shit? Hey, what's up? Freeze, motherfucker, get him here! 
hands up high, Seven. Now, get him up. Over. Now, now you stay on the Seven bed, had bitch. the police Don't on move. the handle. From Don't what move. I knew, what but out of nowhere, they like came, and just like that, it was over. They came for everyone. I was told while locked up, Seven was killed in prison. He wasn't the only one who died that day. I died. Killer died. The whole city died. So it's hot out there. It's just you I know, right? So what's up? You wanna be standing? Just gonna be standing with me. Shit, I'm still in the same spot too, man. Yeah, I went by and got all this shit from your grandma's house the other day too. I'm sorry to hear about that shit too, man. That's what's up. You know when I got knocked off or whatever. My grandma, she wouldn't even accept my calls. Yeah, my grandma. And then I get a letter from my cousin talking about she died. Yeah, you know, that shit fucked me up. I feel you, man. You said you want to holler at nigga Sam today? Nah. We'll do that tomorrow. Let's go get some meat. Some hunger. Hey, what you getting? Just give me a sandwich or something. A sandwich or something? Just a sandwich, it don't matter. Man, I got you, man. Is that you, Ronnie? Yes, yeah, me. I thought you was locked up. I was, I just got out today. Oh, okay. You know you miss Miller's funeral. Mm. Well, all right then. Stay up, baby, and I keep you in my prayers. Yeah, you do that. The day after I got knocked, Miller got murdered right in front of his daughter. They never figured out who did it, but that shit changed the game. You ready to go? Yeah. I'm sitting over here daydreaming this shit, man. That's right. You know what I want to do? No, what's up? Start my own record label. The way Seven wanted. it. Shit, that's what's happening these days. Everybody on that rough shit. But before that, I want to, you know, build my own organization. Like Seven's. I'm talking about beat time. You know what, though? There ain't never been an organization like Seven's or Miller's. But right now, new nigga in town is a cat named Gina. So tell me about this Genie. Good Genie, right? He got a connect. He got the best shit in town. It's my ear by the cop for me. But check this out, though. Don't nobody ever see this nigga, man. Nobody see him? Hell no, you gotta go through Jocka Eddie. But trust me when I tell you, though. Don't shit move without Gina knowing. They got the whole north and the east on lock. Okay, so the west and south. <laughs> Wild ass niggas doing their own thing, man. They loose as fuck. Figures. So I got the west and south. Get this shit some water. Shit, it's needed. But you already know. Look, you do on with you. I'm gonna make you proud. Sam enough? Who? Sam. Who you at, bro? Tell the killer one. Hold on, bro. 
So come on, bro. Sam was a Debo and OP. That's Orange Park. A pretty type nigga, but he was cool. See, I'm gonna be working Duval County, so he can have Clay. It's a highlight tree, you killer. Shit, good, my nigga. Not as good as you, though. Hmm. Ronnie, glad to see y'all, baby girl. Appreciate that. Shit, glad to be out. For sure. So what can I do for you? I need five of them things, Sam. Five, huh, huh? See, what you trying to do? You'll see. I need that good shit. Mm, that good shit, huh? So you need some of that genius shit. I got that. But the only thing is, can't get no discounts. You got to get it like it is. I got you. I'll get back with you in a week. I don't know you good for it. Plus, I fucks with seven. So anything we got going on, you're going to be all right. Thanks, baby. But be safe, though, man. This shit crazy out here right now. Niggas snitching left and right. Niggas jacking. Man, they say a nigga for themselves right now. While I'm getting these off, we need to start building a solid team. After that, we put people on. Make sure the West and South straight. That's what's up. Sounds like a plan. We began to recruit. Seven hit me to the game of chess. So that's how I built my team. I recruited cats I already knew. I was the queen. A very important piece. My knights. One would be a local D-boy who used to also work for Miller. Fingers. He was a live wildlife killer. But girls loved him. He was a smooth talker and good with his hands. I need a killer close to me. My king. Fingers in charge of the West. My two bishops would be White Mike and Will. These two are already good friends. Real go-getters, always hustling. White Mike, trigger happy, and Will, a jack boy. I put them together in charge of the South Side. Now my rooks were knowledge and shine. Knowledge was a young cat still in school, a head bustle. Always ready to deboy a motherfucker, but smart as hell. Shine, I found him in a strip club. I knew he could handle himself. He was from the islands, but real flashy. Those two are my businessmen in charge of the money and daily operations. Then I had eight pawns. I split them by fours to help each side. These are my frontline niggas, ready to kill or be killed. Mostly young cats from different hoods. One pawn I was very fond of was my little nigga, Bishop. He reminded me of Seven. Always in a song and lawyer. So there was my team, lawyer and ready to execute. I'm glad we have a solid team. Now, my goal is to take this team to the top. One of the most powerful and lucrative teams Duval has ever seen. Giving the game some structure and organization. With that being said, welcome. Hey, well check this out, dude. Right now we need 10% for every business. 
the local dope boys, the motherfuckers work for us now, man. Take care of the motherfuckers, take care of y'all, man. 10% from every organization. Plus, we got the crackers on payroll already. Yeah, right. Everybody eating. Yeah, Trust me. Yeah. 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 So, where's the money at? I'm sorry, I don't have it. I mean, I, I get paid Friday. I mean, I, I, I can hook you up. I just I don't have it right now. Can you give me that week? I mean, everybody to listen up and I want all eyes on me. These are the local drug dealers and middlemen all found dead in the past week and a half. So do you know what this means? Do you? It's an ambush. Somebody is knocking off the competition and trying to take over the city. And we don't need another Miller or Seven situation. Let me tell you something, guys. This is my town, all right? So we need to find out who, and we need to find out fast before this thing gets way out of hand. Now that you're on the come up, it's time you start looking like your old fly self and not like you just stepped out of prison yesterday. Bitch, I just got a motherfucking prison. Ain't nobody trying to look cute. Whatever, you're about to figure it out. Let's do this. Excuse me, can I help y'all? Yes, as a matter of fact, you can. My friend here needs to get jazzy. We will be needing some of your best fits. <laughs> well, baby, I don't mean to hurt your feelings tonight, but I don't think y'all can afford anything in here. You got me fucked up, sister girl. Whatever. Um, let's start this over, please. Yeah. I could definitely help you. As a matter of fact, uh -huh. when I get finished with you, you're gonna be so bad, the hoes is gonna hate, and fellas gonna drop. Come on. Step on the scene now, who can it be? I walk across the room and all eyes on me. All eyes on me. Yes, yeah, lights, camera, action. camera action. Check out the strut, you know this look is satisfaction. I'm wrong. Oh. Look at how this thing's shaking. Funky ain't the word, motherfucker, I'm spanking. I rock my hips, they sway. I just see it in them boys' eyes. They can taste me on their lips. Got they hoes wanna trip, cause they men wanna tilt. Coming out they mouth. Get them bust up in they live. Get them bust up in they live. The weather man want my sunshine. You make it rain, boy. I bring the sunshine. A little dirty wine, yeah, I strut like that. No need to wonder how I work my hips like that. She work her hips like that. Get your man's up in the grass. I had to get my gas. I'm on my way. On my way. Time to show for me. First team. Run and play like a coach me. What's it going on, Stan? How you smoking it? I need name up. Hurrah, the new go for me. I be putting you in the game. I be putting you in the game. I be putting you in the game. 
We need some more cups too. Okay. Yeah. And you're welcome, killer. Why you ain't called me? I thought we were supposed to go out Saturday. Hey, baby, you can call me. I'm gonna call you, finger. Damn right. <laughs> what fuck with baby talking about, bro? There's some holes in this bitch, real talk. Man, what the fuck you got that shit on for, man? Take no, man. I'm saying, I don't know. All oh, these motherfucking hoes in here, you worry about your motherfucking dog, bro. Man, look here, man. Damn, fuck you, dog. I know this much, man. You better all that damn bitch in here tonight, bro. Fuck you up. Bro, you hear this shit? <laughs> bro, <laughs> man, these hoes in here choosing, dog. Man. Get off the motherfucking nuts and take on these hoes, dog. Come on, bro. Wild. Mike Wilder, bro. Uh-oh. There's some tenderonies right here. You, you, come on. So what y'all getting into tonight? Shit, you? Oh, really? Damn right. We'll see. You ain't got no homegirls with you? A couple. A couple? All right, all right, that's what we do. Girl, that's Ronnie. Still looking good. Yeah, I know, what's up? Chill, what's up with you? I'm just... Who the fuck is that? I'm talking about this bitch been staring at me all night long. Okay, oh, that's Miller daughter. Shit, I heard she was gay anyway. See, that's, that's a Miller daughter? Yep. They say they hired her to all the niggas in the hood. Shit, it's probably a lot of You know how niggas be lying. Why you want to buy her anyway? What's wrong? I'm trying none of your business. What you looking for? You? For what? Your Miller's daughter? Yes, and you're Ronnie, the new nigga in town. You doing all right, job. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Anyways, I learned everything I know from Seven and your daddy. But I seen you a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, I had a little business meeting. Didn't go too well. Is that right? Mm -hmm. You be here a lot? Nah, not really. Well, whatever. Take my number. I need to holler at you about some other affairs. I'll be calling you. I'll be expecting you. Locks and gold teeth. So take your wire off. You can't fool me. Girl, you cooking breakfast this late in the afternoon? It's like after almost two o'clock. Yep, I make breakfast any time of the day. I guess you got a phone call. Shit. Let me meet you somewhere and talk, cause um I can't do this phone shit. Alright, no problem. Alright, so I'll meet you tomorrow around three o'clock. Alright, guys. So let's get right to it. I want you to work for me. Is that right? Yep. I got my own team. 
You know what I'm saying? Only thing I need is someone to help run the west side with my man Fingers. And um, you know about the game. You know from your daddy or whatever. You got his blood. So I know you love it. And you a killer. I like that. I hear you, but um, shit, I'm good solo. What? How much them niggas paying you? <laughs> Enough. Shit, I'm living good and I'm eating. True. Anyway, just, you know what I'm saying? Think about it and get at me. I love how she be moving, got me thinking about round two before the first round finish. You already know what time it is, let's get down to the finish. And before we go in the fucking, sometime I hold in play. We in the rolling and tussling, damn near kicked over a face. No need for worry or stressing you with a soldier today. So you can have anything and who you can go in the place. I know some spots out in Dallas, I know them rolls in the eight. All the way up the men. See, most meetings, pawns were not required to come. They would get their orders from whomever they worked under. But there was Bishop, standing at attention, with a look of admiration in his eyes. What's up, Glenn? I liked it, but it made me wonder, what was he admiring me about? I was just following in the footsteps of another. Was this really me? Just wanted to talk to you all. See if there's anything that needs to be addressed. Man, there's a problem with this Eddie nigga, man. Where it is, Genie getting pissed. He planning to take over the whole city sooner or later, man. Shit's fucked up right now. Something gotta get, well, I mean, soon. It's enough for everyone to eat. Yeah, that's true. But Eddie sent a message to a punk. He said, Genie said, if you don't shut it down, he gonna do it for you. Shit's real fucked up right now, man. We gotta do something. Damn. So buddy won't budge, huh? <sighs> Ain't shit else to say then. We gonna have to murk this nigga. And they need to let me off that nigga for real. Hell no, nah, nigga. Can't nobody get close enough to him. Need to get somebody he motherfucking trust. So shit, what's the deal, Queen? Hello. Yeah, what's good? Shit, I can't call out her. You was looking for me. Yeah, meet me at the spot. Alright, alright. We head to the spot around 8. Cool. Let me see if she'll work tonight. What's up, girl? Nothing. Hustling. Bored as hell, you know, the usual. Um, slow right now. We should pick up later on. What y'all doing? Girl, Miller had us on the Eddie, so I just had to to get out of the house. I feel you, man. I hate being in the house. Oh, what's going on? Hey, man. Yeah, we went in the game. I got this over here. What's up, my man? Uh, Great Goose. What's up, cuzzo? What's up? Eddie was a nickel and dime dope boy on the east side before he got with this genie character. Now he had the east roped off and jogged the north, but they still answered the genie. Eddie was cool. They called him Eddie in the hood because he sound like Eddie came from the Fire Heartbeats. I got a job. There's 10 stacks in it for you. Shit, you know my questions one way and who. That's why I like them. Well, Jeannie needs a done so. It's half now. The other half when the job is done. As usual, so what's new? It's gotta be some cat. Goes by the name Ryan. Ain't no person. Just making business bags, you feel me? Alright, I'll meet you tomorrow. 
Crazy around here, man. Fuck, man. Shit's fucked up. Hey, y'all ain't hear what happened, yo? Yo. Yo. Man. Shit's crazy, man. They found Eddie dead, shot the fuck up, man. All butt ass naked and shit, man. Man, I don't even know what's going on. Something's crazy around here. I'll be right back. Where you going, Queen? Man, that shit's crazy out here, man. Yo, fuck, man. I was so just crazy. talking to this nigga. So the nigga was what? He was at his house, man. I don't know, man. Let's turn on this news and see this shit, man. Yeah, that's shit. all you gotta be. Just talking to this nigga, man. Hello. So I heard the news. Another business meeting going bad. Like all the other ones. So how much you want for attending that meeting for me? Queen, don't even worry about it, man. I got that shit. That's what's up. So I need to introduce you to the team. Let's say I pick you up tomorrow around one. All right, I'll be ready. All right. Girl, what you cheesing for? Nothing. Mm. Well, you're not gonna believe this, but uh, I heard Eddie got killed. Mm, is that right? Yeah, but you don't seem surprised. I mean, hey, you know how this game go. You live by the sword, you die by it. I guess. So, you ever tried calling Shh. killer? Girl, that's why I'm here tonight. I need you to help me find a fit. We're going out tonight. Oh, all right, let's go to the house. Cool, let me grab my purse. So 
what you get? I don't know yet. You get that chicken and shrimp Alfredo. Mm. Is it good? Yeah, yeah it's good. But I'll get the same thing. Are you guys ready to order? Yeah. You get um two chicken and shrimp Alfredo. Okay, I'll read right back with that for you guys. So, you guys seven were friends, huh? Seven was my nigga, man. Shit, we cool since we were little. Mm -hmm. Well, Ronnie's my best friend. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sure, I like the conversation we had on the phone the other night. When you know, going to school and got goals and shit. I did that shit, man, for real. Uh, you seem cool, too. I just wish you had another name. Another name? <laughs> you don't like Killer? Mm -hmm. I don't give up my government. You call me D, though. Okay, D. That's much better. Be careful, little hot. But I'll come back and check on you. Thanks. I love these movies, man. Cartoons, D. Man, cartoons, man, some good dogs, man. You deep, you be on that deep shit. You yeah, like, trust me. Okay. Yeah, man, Eddie's dead. Yeah, I know you want this Ronnie bitch taken care of. Shit, I want the whole team taken down. Yeah, this shit needs to be done. All right, I'll call Kenny and Sergeant Davis. I'm on it. All right, boss, I got you. For sure. This is La Miller. She gonna be the new knight to this organization. I don't get it twisted. Her pedigree runs deep. This Miller's daughter. Hmm. Oh, That's what it is. We got you on what else? All right. Well then, um, loosen up, y'all. Let's eat shit. Yeah, right. Ooh. Man, where the fuck kill at, man? No, I don't know, but uh, I'll just feel him in later whenever I see him. What's up, bro? What's happening, nigga? Long time no see. What you been up to, dog? Same shit, different day grinding. I hear that, I hear that. When I came by your mama house looking for you today, she said she barely even see you. Bro? Yeah, yeah. Man, I be trying to stay away from that dog as much as possible, dog. It be crazy. But I be yeah. chilling at my boy house. Yeah. Yeah. Some real shit. Nigga, I know some Miami cats looking for some work for a good ass price. You know what I'm saying? I know you can hook that up. You sure you check them out? They ain't purples, isn't it? straight, bro. I got you, bro. What you think I am? Alright bro, I'm gonna hit you up later on. Let me know what they need. I'll hook that shit up. 
So. But dog, don't be bullshitting me, bro. Don't bullshit, man. I told you, bro. I got you. Just hook that up for me. Alright, that's what's up. Alright, let's go. Right about See, this is when the police began watching me, and they figured if they could slowly get members of my team, they would begin to snitch. What's up, bro? You still need that? Yeah, yeah, you still got it? Yeah, I got that, babe. Let's meet later on around two. Right back. Over there off of East Adams where we used to meet them bras back in the day. All right, bro. Let me check that shit out, man. Get that shit all up? Yeah, yeah, it's all up. Oh, don't be bullshitting with me, dog. I ain't playing, man. It's all that. Uh, you got my shit. Let me check that shit out. That's what's working. Yeah. Punk ass motherfucker, you rolled on me, nigga. Shit down by. Call me over here so you can try to fuck me so I can fuck it up with my old girl. You already know if I fuck it, ain't gonna change shit. We still ain't gonna be together, man. She ain't gonna do nothing but make you act more crazy. You can keep that shit, though, for real. Get to the next nigga, man. Well, no, I don't even bring your tired ass around. How long you fuck with that bra with your tired ass? Oh, ain't got time for you, bro, but you got time for these hoes? Look, here for once, don't motherfucking touch me, man. The only reason I'm not lying here now is because of this shit. This nigga see this motherfucking son in peace without this bullshit, man. We ain't gonna be together, though. I don't fuck with you like that, man. For real. Oh, so that's your bitch? Yeah, it's my motherfucking bitch. Fuck you, killer! Daddy, don't go! Come on, mommy. I'll be back to see you, all right? What else I'll be good for you, mommy. You really moving in with us, huh? Yes, I am. You might really like the company. <laughs> no. <laughs> I like men. Speaking about men. Guess what killer at? What? He asked me to get serious. And what you say? I said yes, but I ain't studying that shit. He just like the rest of these niggas around here. Besides, he's not BF material. <laughs> BF material? What the fuck is BF material? Boyfriend material? <laughs> he ain't all that street shit. When I decide to settle down, I mean, he has to be either a college grad, have a legit job, making at least 40K, a wholesome man, not a thug. So why you just ain't telling me you wanted to be friends? 
because I didn't want to hurt his feelings. And besides, he's really good in bed, and I ain't about ready to let that go. Hello? I need you to get over here right away. What's wrong? Just come now. Hey, where you going? Hey, what am I supposed to do with all these boxes? Bitch, you got not yesterday. But I have attorneys on it. He also faces some serious time. Dog, I just told Bishop about fucking with all these extra niggas, man. What the fuck happened? Somebody set him up. He was doing a deal, and the cops came. No, the shit was stupid. First of all, he went by himself. Then he trusted a little nigga without even checking him out and shit. Anyways, the Mill and Killer, I need y'all to find out who this nigga was he was doing the deal with and kill his ass. Right. Yeah, and I need you to go down to the jail, figure out what he needs, you know what I'm saying? And let him know why I cannot be there. Explain to him that we all support him. You know what I'm saying? Lamilla, come walk with me. Y'all just chill out. What's happening with you, little nigga? I'm surviving. Surviving, huh? I hear that. You know why Ronnie couldn't make it, man? Say she hope you understand that shit. Yeah, bro, it's cool. I ain't studying that shit. Be checking on you from time to time to make sure you got everything you need in all, my nigga. Man, first, I'm gonna need some money. Second, I need somebody to give Erica and the baby a ride up here to see me so they ain't gotta catch the bus and shit. You know we got your couple. That's what's up, that's what's up. Man, no matter what dog them lawyers say they're gonna give me, I'm looking at at least 15. It's too much evidence. They say the only way I'm getting out of this bitch is by snitching on Ronnie, and you know that shit ain't happening. But tell Ronnie, though, dog, that the lawyer's gonna hit up and let him know what's up. Hey, CO! Time's up! I guess I'll be seeing you in about 10, dog. Keep your head up in this bitch, my nigga. I got you. So that's it? That's some bullshit. What the fuck I'm paying you for? I swear, I cannot stand the system. They getting them 10 with a possibility of parole in like seven. Can you believe that shit? They trying him as an adult? Yeah. They got him. They got him. Right then, a tear rolled down my eye. Before anyone could see it, I wiped it. For the first time in life, it hit me. This shit I was doing was wrong. A 16-year-old would spend his first adult years when he should be in college and exploring the world, in prison with murderers and rapists, 
and a child would spend their first years when learning to tie their shoe or multiply, fatherless. All because a boy admired me, or at least what I portrayed to be. Yo, what's happening, Kenny? I was the JLC. Kenny was an ex-Marine who got kicked out for fighting. He was known as crazy in the hood. Even the toughest niggas was scared of Kenny. Because he ain't the type of cat to just shoot you. He the type of cat to cut your heart out your chest while you still alive. Psycho nigga. But I had never seen him. Just heard about him. Shit, man, we need you to kill this new nigga Ronnie. Shit, you know, you can get the info from Killer. You know Killer, right? You talking about that nigga stay off the touch, No problem. For sure, man. Shit, we gonna need you to carry nigga Sam, too. He's supposed to be the supplier. You know, we trying to send a message. Well, that's the deal. When we get done, we get back at you. Well, shit, burn them niggas down. What's up? For sure. Next coming up, I got my man Ant all the way from New York. Y'all give him a round of applause. Y'all gotta hear this motherfucker. He real good. What's going on tonight? Um, I'm gonna do an old piece called Guarded. And then she was here. See, she wasn't before, but now she was there. She had trespassed over the gates that I had so well built. It was not here to stare me face to face, shameless, no guilt. She had avoided every landmine that I had so well hidden. It was not here. Not knowing my past, but already forgiving. It was as if someone had showed her a secret past just to right here, right now. She had practically teleported here somehow. See, I didn't believe in falling in love, but this bruise that lied atop my head had come from somewhere. It would be a good explanation for why I get lightheaded, you know, weak in the knees whenever I'm within her stare. So I thought to myself, I might as well listen to what she had to say, because I had been fending off intruders for a while and I knew one would make it through one day. So I sat down and I stared at you. And as you opened your mouth, I mentally prepared for you. To be honest, I was actually scared of you. But I took the time to look at the woman that stood before this humbled man and realized there was something for which I didn't make a defensive plan. There was a sense of calm and protection that took over me while we talked. You had surpassed all my defenses. It was now here staring me face to face. It's because, unlike humans, angels don't walk. Ooh, geez. Hey, don't go into the restroom. Damn, this is like the Godfather. <laughs> <laughs> Exclusive. Nothing exclusive, so mm -hmm. she. She'd be no problem. I get your phone. Yeah. It's 772? 50? 50? Yeah, 54. 
It's 904. 904? Yeah. 54. So when is it good to call you? Man, y'all see this shit? Man, she better hope Killer don't come out the bathroom. That nigga stay ready for some shit to pop off, man. Bitch, wildin'. What the fuck is wrong with your friend? I don't know. Just go get her, cause I don't need no unnecessary problems tonight. Excuse me, can I borrow my friend for a minute? Bye. Fuck you grabbing me. Have you lost your mind? What? Killer will kill you, that's what. Man, I ain't worried about no motherfucking killer. I got killer under control. You need to worry about you. You's a stupid ass bra. Sit down. <laughs> Took you so long. You know they had to get right now. I done told you about that pill shit. I need your ass alert. You worry about me. I stay ready to pop over. Anyways, I got a surprise. These. All the tickets to Moy. I figured we all need a vacation. We leave on Friday and we'll be back on Monday. Yes. Bad bitches in the mouth. This your nigga nephew. <laughs> Seem like nowadays everybody wanna talk that dope talk. Huh? Huh? Thousand grams this, thousand grams that. Last time my chick. I got this feeling. What you mean you got this feeling? Just a feeling. I think I'm ready to quit this shit. We just got good. What you talking about? This don't feel right. I mean, first this bishop shit. Now the genie beef. All this got me about to lose my sanity. Well, just think about it. You know it's all a part of life. You know it comes with the territory. You know that. But people dying, getting locked up. My conscience starting to fuck with me. I lost my conscience a long time ago. I wonder if I'm losing mine. You know what I'm saying? Speaking of stupid, I got a cousin. She's so damn stupid. I said, girl, you better get ready for this recession that's about to take place. She told me, how many people gonna be there, Carl? Hello? Hey, Kenny, what's going on? Ooh, tonight not a good night. I'm house sitting for a friend. Yeah. Okay, you can come over. It's 97.45, touched and rolled. Cool, I see you then. I seen you with this nigga at the club the other night. Who was that nigga right there? That's seven. Him and Killer were best friends. No. But Killer used to work for him. He practically ran the city. But now he works with my best friend. Your best friend? Yeah, Ronnie. What, Ronnie a man or something? <laughs> no, a girl. You saw her the other night when we were going to the bathroom. Damn, what's with these women running a dough trade like that? What? Nothing, I feel pissed though. Uh -huh. 
Bathrooms to the left when you walk out. Whose bathroom is that back there? Nobody's in particular. He let his boy Bishop use it before he got locked up. Bishop? Who's Bishop? Yeah, Bishop worked on the killer. Oh, basically, he worked for Ronnie, huh? Yeah, you can say that. Mm, let's see. I look for all they talk about who's who. Let's see, come on, dude. Up now, I'm saying what you peeping the scene, bro. Wait, no, cuz. Shit, I'm lost, cuz. Hey, y'all, he I'm lost. Shoot yeah. the police, man. The man, I said I'm lost. No, Back man. Back up the car, man. What? Back up the car. Man, I should lay your ass out. Hey, hey. Man, get the fuck from around here, too, bro. <laughs> Say, bro, tighten up. What's going on, my nigga? Chill, chill. Y'all boys have no this shit in the fort. Y'all already know. Oh, what's up? Check this out. Word is, Lisa has some nigga over here Friday. Mm -hmm. He ain't leave the Saturday. Oh, y'all niggas heard this shit? Yeah, yeah. Y'all niggas serious though? Straight, Straight up. Yeah. Shit, that's what's happening. Nigga, I'm gonna fuck with y'all boys. Y'all get yeah. at me, man. Yeah, you already know it, bro. Why? Sit the fuck down. What the What's wrong? What the fuck this nigga had in my motherfucking house? I don't house, have bro? anybody in your house. That's your one more motherfucking time. Who the fuck is I don't have anybody over here. Fuck kill you breaking a nigga in my motherfucking but, house like that, man. But baby, please. You gotta understand. I don't have no, nobody no, no. here. Get your shit please. and get the fuck out. No, please. Just get your <laughs> shit and get the fuck out. Bitch. <laughs> What can I get for it? You got a um, double shot of goose and cranberry. Get her um, hypnotic or some shit. No problem. What's going on with you? Shit. Well, I'm glad you called me because um, shit been crazy as hell. Been getting on my last fucking nerves out there. <laughs> it's fucked up because we got another situation. So what's that? We found that nigga Sam dead, man. Got a chest piece on him. That's why somebody cut this nigga from Idia, man. What the fuck? She fucked up. Virginia playing dirty, man. Without our connect, the fuck we gonna do now? I got somebody for now, so whatever. I just gotta contact them, you know what I'm saying? We'll do that tomorrow. Anyways, Lisa called me. Left the message crying on my machine, whatever. What's going on? <laughs> Fuck Lisa, man. How about where we're going, right? Bitch had a nigga in my house. Just straight trying a nigga. Like I wasn't gonna find out or some shit, man. Oh, what well, that shit. I love Lisa to death, but if it was me, I'd try to kill her ass too. You don't know, man. I want to kill that bitch so bad, man. I just said, Fuck it. Hoes gonna be hoes. Shit, it is what it is, man. True. Damn. What the fuck wrong with Lisa? What's up? It's your boy Truth coming in all the way live. Finna let y'all know how it is on my week. Yeah. This time a nigga serious, no talking nigga listen To the top of the block in the mansion, that's my position These niggas, they ain't dumb, they know what I be facing Whole niggas got their nuts crossed, praying, hoping I don't make it Better zip up and close your mouth from the newest sensation Just look at me like a musician, bitch, I'm that amazing My grip be out for safety, so test your luck, complain I'm pulling out that street, sweeping all them butt shots, spraying I know why niggas hating, and be gasped like bitches Cause on my grind and getting mine, steady stacking my riches But fuck nigga, listen 
Ain't no stop lead. Try me if you want. Your head price will be less than a G. The new legacy. How top that's OT. You don't know about me. Ask about me. Born many streets. Making my way through. I'ma take it if I can't have it. Demanding me a spot to the top to show you who was savage. Oh, nothing. I'll be right back. I'm just trying to do some other shit, like... What's up? Can I talk to you for a minute? Yeah, baby, do I know you? No, but let me just get a minute. Yeah, that's cool. Alright, this is what it is. Starting my own record label. And um, I want my music, you know, to have a message. Like your music. So what I'm trying to say is, I want to make you my first artist. You know, manager. I don't really see myself like vibing in with all these local niggas and stuff, you know? <laughs> first of all, I mean, I know what you're thinking. And uh, money, I have plenty of that. And if I don't have enough, then I'll get it. So, you know what I'm saying? I'll invest time in you and promote you correctly. You know what I'm saying? I just want the world to hear what I just heard. You know, take a gamble on me and um, put your trust in me. Uh, I see, but um, I ain't gonna change my swag and my style, my sound or nothing like that, you feel me? Don't worry about all that, baby. I don't wanna change none of that. You just give me six months and trust me, we gonna do it. All right, well, let me get your number. You know, I'll let you put up. Ronnie. Make sure you call me. I'm sure. What's up? I'm starting a record label. Oh, you? Yeah, that's going to be my first artist. You want to look right now? Mm-hmm. That's what's up? Yeah. No. Remember you? How's it been? Good. So you got that? So here. Check it out. Is she good, nigga? Good. It's the best. Check that out, baby. Nice doing business with you. I'll be in touch. I always wondered was God a woman. Excuse me? I mean, never thought I'd see a chick take over the game. Hello? Hey, Kenny. Well, what you mean? This Lisa. <laughs> Quit playing, you know you... Hello? <laughs> this bitch didn't just hang the phone up on me. Shh. Big news tonight, girl. For real, what's up? Your girl is finally giving this shit up. 
said, I figured that much. You know if you done, you know I'm done. Try call and kill him. I ain't getting no answer. Damn. I wonder where the fuck he at. You know? Shit tonight, you know what I'm saying? Just enjoy yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like, I want to get up on one of them little girls or something. I might be tripping or something. I don't know. Ronnie, Ronnie, this nigga ran this way. We gotta go get this nigga. Get up. Get up. Get up. Fucking brains out. I know who sent you. I got one question. What the fuck is Genie? <laughs> Niggas always fuck shit up. Jasmine? So we meet again. Seems like we're always in competition. What the fuck you doing here? 
Now you should know of all people. It takes some estrogen to take over the whole city. Genie? See, now you're starting to get it. See, Seven, Seven thought he kept me out the loop, but I was more in it than he was. See, I listened, I paid attention. When the moment was right, I took him out. It was you. You set him up. And you got me locked up. For how? Easy. I learned from the best. And as I can see, you did too. Nice to see you, little Miller. My dad, that was you? See, when I was fucking your daddy, he taught me a lot about his organization, a lot about the game. It was not the personal, just business. Fuck it? You two were fucking? Uh, I hope you don't think you and Seven were having all the fun. Shit, I didn't know. Shit, how could she? You didn't even know. See, Seven raised me like he raised you. Only difference is with me, is that he didn't know he was raising a killer. I couldn't believe it. The man we both loved created monsters. Lisa made it, but lost the baby. Remarkably, Killer made it too. Come to find out, Seven wrote a letter to Killer while in jail and told him if anything ever happened to Jasmine to take Seven Jr. Right after I got in jail, I found out I was pregnant by Seven. No one ever knew. But one other person, I named him Supreme, and Lamilla also kept a promise. They all moved to Atlanta and launched their own record label. They named it Supreme Sevens. Come to find out, Kenny did not shoot Killer. It was Bree. Bishop started rapping in prison. So I know he got a deal when he get out. So I guess it is what it is. But I was not a product of my environment. I was a product of my man. We as black men must be exact and right in our ways because our women are a reflection of us. And what we instill in them, they pass on to our children. Black men, let's build and stop destroying.